what is going on guys this is Asim Arif and today in this tutorial we will be seeing how to recover a Facebook password without email and phone number I mean to say if you have lost access to the phone number or the email that's linked to your Facebook account then in that case you can still recover your Facebook password and the process that I will show you can also be applied in case of hacked Facebook accounts so guys if your Facebook account is hacked then keep watching this video but firstly hit the like button share this video with all your friends and if this is first time you are watching this video then hit the subscribe button press the notification bell and select all to stay updated with all my new videos so without any further delay let's get started So guys for recovering your Facebook password or hacked Facebook account there are some necessary conditions which must be fulfilled. You will get to know about those after watching this video completely so guys it is my request to you please watch the video till end. The video can be long but each and every step is going to be very important so watch it till end. So now let's get started. Firstly I will use any random browser here like this one and then we will go to facebook.com. Okay, now the first step here is to search your Facebook account. Now listen me carefully. If your account is not hacked and you have just forgotten your Facebook password, then you will know the email address or mobile phone number linked with your account. So simply you can use your email address or phone number here to find your account. But if your account is hacked, then hacker might have changed the contact details. Okay, then but in most cases hacker doesn't delete your old email address or phone number linked with your account. So in that case you can use your old phone number or email address here to find your account. But I'm supposing here that the hacker was clever and deleted your old contact details. Then what you have to do is to go to your friend's Facebook account. And search your account here by your full name. Guys this is a Facebook account which I'm going to recover. Now tab on these three dots and copy this profiles link now go back to the browser and paste that link here remove all the text before this numeric id we only use this numeric uh, user id to find our account and guys if you have set your custom username then you will paste your custom username here then leave the password section empty and tab on login then you will see this error message now simply tab on did you forget your password then select try another way then you will see all the contact details linked with your facebook account here only the phone number is linked and i have lost access to that so i will need to tab on no longer have access to these and guys this is the uh, message that most people will see and will comment down below that we are getting this message no phone access or no email access that's why i showed you everything practically so that all your doubts get clear now i'm going to share with you those conditions which must be fulfilled for recovery process so condition number one is you have to do this process using that mobile phone from which you created your facebook account condition number two you will need to use the browser where your account was logged in before and from which you created your facebook account Condition number three, the internet connection and the location should be same. If you are following these three conditions, then you will get the recovery options from the Facebook team. Here I'm using the same mobile phone and the same internet connection, but I'm not using the same browser or app where my account was logged in before. Okay, my account was logged in in the official Facebook app, so I will need to use this app to recover my Facebook account. And if you were logged in in the browser, then you will use the browser. Okay, now I will tab on find your account. And there is another important thing that you need to keep in mind here is that uh, if your account was also logged in in the official Facebook app like me then you will need to use your email address or phone number to find your account. You can see here that I am pasting the numeric id here but it is not uh, searching the account so you will need to keep in mind this thing. As, but as I told you before that hacker doesn't delete your old contact details so you can use your old phone number or email address here to find your account. Now guys you can see here that we have successfully found our Facebook account. Now if I tab on no longer have access to these then you can see here that now we are getting the recovery options. Now you need to enter the new email address here which is not used in any Facebook account before. Okay so I'm going to enter the new email address. This email address is not linked with any Facebook account and then facebook team will send an email on this mail address now simply tap on the next button then you will see this page we need a copy of your id then again tap on next then tap on allow 
and take a picture of your government issued documents. You can use your government issued identity card, driving license or passport here. But make sure the name and the date of birth mentioned in your documents should exactly match with your Facebook account. If these details don't match with your account then you will get a negative response from Facebook team. Okay, after taking a picture, now simply tap on the submit button and then it will, it will start uploading to the Facebook server. So guys now our uploading is successfully completed and now firstly I will show you the email address which I added there. So guys you can see here that there is no new mail from the Facebook team currently. You can see it is the same mail address which I added there. But there is no new mail. So now we will need to wait for an email from the Facebook team. So guys I will be back when I will receive an email. Guys I am back after 2 minutes and I just received an email from the Facebook team. But first let me show you the mail address so that it get confirmed I am not making any kind of fake video. You can see here it is the same mail address which we added there and this is the new mail received. Thanks for confirming your identity to finish getting back into your account, log out of any Facebook account, open on your computer, phone or tablet and now click the following link to reset your password. Now, so now we will tab on this link and boom guys now you can see here that we are getting an option of create a new password so now we will enter a new password here so let me enter password and after that we will tab on the next then you will see this page now select review other devices you must do this step because it will help you to log out your account from the hacker's device if it is it is still logged in there okay and then select log out of all sessions Then select logout and guys now you can see here that we are successfully logged into our Facebook account. I will also show you the profile here. You can see you can check the profile picture it is the same profile picture and now to make you more satisfied I will also show you the e email address and phone number by going to the settings. So now let's jump into the settings of the Facebook account. So we will go to the settings. Here are the settings. Now I will refresh the page once. Now we will go to personal information. Here you can see guys it is the same email address. You can check the mail it is the same mail. And now here you can see it is the same phone number. I hope that you are now completely satisfied. So guys this was all about today's video. I hope that you enjoyed the video. If you did give this video a huge thumbs up. Share the video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Catch you in the next video. Till that, goodbye.